Okay, welcome back guys, Gun and Fan, and today we are looking at this guy. What was that? I am a gun Alright, so this turned up yesterday. Um, this is like a little private little purchase, so it's um, not a paid product or whatever uh, promotion. So it's a little private project for me. Um, I saw it on AliExpress really, really cheap. Um, but it's not an endorsement for the website or anything like that. It's just, that's why I picked it up. Uh, it was at a price that was like silly not to. You know when you see something and you think, that's really cheap, I'm going to pick it up. Uh, it was one of those situations to the point where I didn't believe it was real, but because it was so cheap, I thought, eh, I'll, I'll give it a punt. If it turns out to be, um, you know, a, sca a scam, I just won't use the site anymore. And here we are. Um, yeah, true to form, it came well packaged. Uh, there is a scratch down there. Uh, that's my fault because um, I, I, I just used the knife. Didn't know what it was. Couldn't remember um, because it came in bubble wrap and um, a black bag. It came in this, so um, I was expecting. I was, what is this? Is it like an Amazon order or something like that? So I, I ripped it open with the knife and I scratched the box. And I was like, and I, I pulled it to one side. I was like, ah, well, I weren't scammed. Um, so yeah, um, this is the Glory Eternal Star uh, from Supreme Evolution. Um, I've not built anything from them before, I don't think. Um, so this is their their rendition of the Stargazer. Um, so this is probably not going to be on sale at gunplay.co.uk because of the ties to Bandai. So this is a third-party kit, and uh, I think it's like their imagining of the Stargazer. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. Uh, but I don't know nothing about either um, the Stargazer or, or this. So I looked at it. I was, I was on the fence at first. I thought, nah, I don't know, because um, I'm a little bit fussy when it comes to third parties. It's got to blow my mind for me to go, yeah, I want that. But the price, it was the price that got me. I'm not going to tell you how much I paid for it, but, um, yeah, it, it sort of swayed me a little bit. So I thought I'd, I'd get one to check it out, show you guys, because I don't know nothing. So when I open this box, it's going to be, you know, a first first time experience. So uh, we're going to see what's inside. I don't know whether it's got a metal frame, plastic frame. I don't know whether it comes with effect parts or anything. Um, all I know is the silhouette. Uh, that's it. Um, I'm not. I don't really do that much research into these kits or whatever. If I like it, I'll get it. That, that's. I'm a simple guy. Um, so we're going to unbox this today. Have a little look. See. <clears throat> There's some more promotional art front and back. Um, it doesn't look too bad at all. Um, it kind of has the same sort of energy as the ruling by In Era. So I don't know whether they are linked to that, but this design um, is fantastic. It looks like it has some sort of backpack gimmicks. Um, the posy looks really good. Um, and I think you can get like a, it, um, third party light rings that go around it. Um, <coughs> Super Harrow, uh, as you might know or follow, excuse me. <coughs> Oh, sorry about that. Uh, Super Harrow is probably um, the best to, to, to check and follow. I'll, I'll link his account below. Check him out uh, because he's always posting some really good um, leaks and artworks and, you know, what you're going to get in the box and stuff like that. So definitely check him out. But we're going to open this. Uh, see what's inside. Thank you again so much for the new followers, subscribers and stuff like that. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Leave comments down below if you're interested, um, like, you know, or you know more about this company or this kit or anything like that. Um, it is not affiliated with uh, Bandai whatsoever, um, but it is, I think, 1-100 scale. Oh, it's 1.99.9 scale plastic one of kit, so... Uh, yeah. So it's not one one hundred. <laughs> it's one one thousand. Uh, okay, I, I don't understand that, but anyway, we're going to get to the, the bottom of it and have a look inside, and I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thank you.
That's a shame. It's under gate at the bottom, but not on the sides of the V fin. Someone commented on my Twitter saying that the effect parts are mid. What do you think? Quite a few runners. Oh, see, so it doesn't have an action display stand, it has an action display support. And I think that this part here <clears throat> is um, the first edition. Um, I do think that later editions might be a different colour and might not include the effect parts because that's kind of how they do things, just to drum up interest. They give gifts and like the ruling had, no, not the ruling, I can't remember now, come of the cloak, Thor, come of the cloak with the first edition. So you're gonna use all these parts on the full. Oh yeah, it's just times two, times two, yeah. So that is all of the sprues and all of the parts. So you're gonna be using everything. It does look a very simple build. I do like a nice simple build, but because of the geometry of the parts, it just makes for a really, really interesting build. It doesn't necessarily have to be like loads and loads of layers of, of individual parts if the scribing's done correctly and done well. So you can like literally build something with maybe three or four pieces and it just look like it's more complicated than, than it is. So that's kind of efficient. doesn't have a metal frame um, which is not a, a 
a bad thing, but I do like those metal frame kits. And I can't wait to get my hands on the next one because the ruling was fantastic. and clean and understandable. Speaking of which, are they water slides? Yes they are. Nice. And you've got some uh, foils as well if you wish to use blues or the greens or both, I don't know. Yeah they're blue or green so I'm probably inclined to use the blues because it's like a white grey uh, kit so I'm not really a fan of green foils to be fair. Um, and the water slides look colourful and decent and they are well printed as well uh, sometimes you get some from some brands and the writing is just like like it's been done by AI so it's all doesn't you can't read it but you can read these markings so very nice okay a little bit of a different one with a bit of narrative over the top uh, so leave comments below if you've got any any anything to add um, or you've got any questions, I don't know whether I'll be able to answer them, but, you know, chat amongst yourselves, and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. Center of gravity. Bisexuality. This is what it does. It appeals like the male fantasy. Screw gravity. Call up Sean Hannity. It's a bold strategy. Inside our galaxy. We're snapping back to reality. Oh, there goes gravity. Mom, spaghetti. <laughs> 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 <laughs>